squat, so you gotta call them. Okay, so wherever they go, you're going to do that. Squats are going to med ball. Okay, med balls, we're going to the RDL. Now, who do you think you ladies are going to call them? Yeah, you're going right to the base. You'll always call the base. Okay, you're going to have a timer going on and off. You're going to hear a buzz going in the background. It'll be music, but you're going to hear a thing. Every time you hear that, it's either going to start or stop your exercise. The first round is going to be 20 seconds, and you're going to have to do eight reps. Okay? On this exercise, I'm allowing you to only do six because it's really two, a curl and a press. So I have to do eight band pulls. I have to do eight squats, eight med balls, eight RDLs, and how many curls? Six, because I'm giving you a break on that because it's a double exercise. But you have to do those reps in the 20 seconds. So in 20 seconds, you got to get squats. If I can do eight reps in 20 seconds and I finish before the buzzer goes off, what do you think that tells me about the weight that I pick? It's too light. It's not enough. Because I want to be working out somewhere for almost that whole 20 seconds. Now let's say I finish rep number eight and I put the dumbbell down and the buzzer goes off. Well, I'm probably at a good weight right there. Don't feel the pressure that you have to grab something heavier and never get to complete all your reps. If I'm pulling on the green band and I'm getting eight good pulls in the 20 seconds and it feels light, then I'm just gonna tie an extra band. If I'm getting eight pulls and I'm struggling to get it, then that's fine. Maybe you just pull and pause for a second and then you release it up and make it a little harder that way. All right, but understand, you have to select the weight because if you're just coasting through the workout, you're not gonna get the benefits of it. And I don't know what weight necessarily to tell you to lift. I can watch your technique and suggest, but if you can lift heavier, you have to have that inside to say, I'm gonna grab five pounds heavier. Or that is too heavy, I can't do this, I need to drop my weight a little bit, okay? I'm gonna get the buzzer going so you can hear it, but remember which location you're going next. After you finish your eight reps, you'll hear a buzzer go off, and then you're gonna have 40 seconds to rest, and it gets your next spot. So if I do my band pull down, once I do my eight, and that 40 seconds, that's your rest. I get over to my next exercise, I catch my breath, I may have to change out my weights, but when the buzzer goes off again, I gotta be ready to start that next exercise right away. So in that 40 seconds, if you're changing weights, you gotta be getting on the ball to do that, okay? Does that make sense? We only have these five exercises. You have those reps. We're gonna go through three times today. Every week, we'll add another round. So next week, we'll do four rounds. And next week, we'll do five. When we get to the summer, we'll keep it going. And then we'll switch when we finish this week, okay? All right, let's try it out. I'm gonna get the buzzer for